Hey, what's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Fox's Productions. So, I'm back with another video. So, after a long time, a reacting video. So, yeah, let's do this. Okay. So, today I'll be reacting to America Got Talent Most Dangerous Illusions of the Year. Let's do this. Sharp, yes? It's facing straight up so that if anything gets slammed down upon it, it will become impaled. Now we don't know which bag this spike is in because before the show, one of the backstage crew placed it in one of the bags. Since we don't know, this makes it exciting for us and for you. That's right. Now, so far during the live rounds, there has not been an axe to get four axes and been sent home. If I stop this, kids, don't try this at home. Serious. Okay, guys, let's go. But tonight, that might change. Heidi, during this trick, if at any time we slam down the wrong bag, sending the spike through our hand and sending blood everywhere, it's your job to hit that fourth and final buzzer and send us home. <laughs> Adding insult to injury. The pressure is on, man. Each one of the judges is going to choose a bag for us to smash. If I was in your spot and somebody said choose a bag, I would choose bag A, but that's just because I like immediate gratification. It is true. Now, we're more like me, you choose bag E because it's on the opposite end of the spectrum and you just don't trust Lehman. Now we should tell you most people would choose bag C. We're not telling you that so you do choose bag C. We're not telling you that so you don't choose bag C. We're just telling you that so you're informed. Now the D bag is least likely to be chosen because... <laughs> Nobody wants to be one. Okay. And there is one bag that we have not mentioned and we won't. So, we'll begin with uh, the King of Alameda, Howard Stern. Which bag would you like us to smash first? Well, I guess I gotta go for the D bag. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. <laughs> We have two bags left. Nikana, can you join us on stage or stand right behind the bags? <laughs> Nikana, everybody. Okay. Now, at the beginning, we said there's a spike in one of the bags, and we believe there's a spike in one of the bags. But the question is, do you believe there's a spike in one of these bags? Yeah, I guess. Ooh, this, this is going to be very dramatic. dramatic. Oh, this is going to be good. Nick, go ahead and hold both hands over each bag. No. Oh, oh. it's fine. It's fine. It's it's gonna be up, yeah. because we're gonna trust your intuition, your sense. Do you have a feeling of which bag you think is safe? As soon as you have a feeling of which bag is safe, leave that hand above the bag. The other hand you can let rest at your side. The one that I think is safe. No, the spike. one without the spike. Without the spike, okay. Bag C, yeah, that's, that's your choice. <laughs> no, we would never actually do that. Immoral, unethical, Not just really unethical. But you are up here to make sure we do what we said we're gonna do. We just match all the bags except for one, and you think bag C is safe. Yes. We can set up both of our wrists with each hand. One, two. Wait, 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 wait. How do you never got to choose a bag? I didn't. Would you like to stick with Nick's decision or switch bags? I switch. 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 <laughs> you sure? All right. One, two, two three. three. Oh! oh, Nick, thank you for choosing. Heidi, thank you for switching. Because if you hadn't, you would have gotten the fourth and final X. It is a real spike. Please give Nick Cannon a huge round of applause. Wow. Thank you, Nick. I almost killed you guys.
What in the world? How are you, how are they doing that? As you can see, the bot bottom of it is um one kind of it's a uh, open space and h how is he doing that? Like seriously? Let's just move on to the video. I hope you're enjoying. I'm sorry I can't narrate anything. I can't talk anything because I'm really into the into the video. So yeah, let's go.